Hi, welcome back to the Crossroads Calligraphy YouTube channel. My name is Renee and my pronouns are she and her and I'm coming to you from uh, ancestral Tohono O'odham land here in southern Arizona. And today I'm sharing my favorite way to prepare a brand new nib for calligraphy as well as a couple tips about how to handle a calligraphy nib and how to insert it into a straight holder. So let me flip the camera and I'll get started. Okay, so we have how to handle a nib. You slide it to the edge of the table and pinch the back of the nib between your fingers. Hold it gently and don't squeeze the tines together. Now to insert it in my holder, I'm finding the space in the ring at the top of the pen staff and I want to try to line up the edge of the nib with the reservoir to that space in the holder. Okay, now you can see in the holder there's a space in the middle with some kind of teeth in, in the center of it. I want to try to insert the back of the nib between the teeth and the ring at the top of the pen staff. If I put it in the middle, it's not going to fit. So I'm <laughs> looking in the camera trying to do this and then I... I'm getting smart here. Okay, so then I fit the nib in between the ring and the teeth. Okay. So you can see the reservoir, the edge of the nib, and that space are all lined up. Now I'm gonna show you how to prep a new calligraphy nib. So I've inserted a brand new one into the pen holder and I'm trying to show that the ink isn't really sticking to the nib. Um, remember that new nibs have a protective coating and that prevents rust. Uh, it prevents moisture from getting, to the, uh, getting onto the nib and coating the nib. So if you take a look here, you can see it's only really on the front of the nib. It's not um, coating the nib at all. Okay. And so we are going to have to remove that protective coating. So I'm just going to clean off the ink that I grabbed with a paper towel. And all I'm going to do is uh, grab some saliva and proceed with cleaning all the protective coating off of the nib. Now I normally do this two or three times just because I don't want to do it over again later. I like to do a really thorough cleaning in the first place but I'm also being very careful in using gentle pressure with my fingers because I don't want to bend the tines of my brand new nib. If you bend the tines then uh, it interferes with the way that ink flows down the nib to the paper and uh, you won't be able to use the nib. So now I'm just giving it a good wipe again, uh, gently with the paper towel. And hopefully here you'll be able to see the difference in um, how much more ink is actually um, staying on the nib now. So as before, it was only toward the edge of the nib. The ink is sticking all the way up toward the number um, that's near the pen staff. So you can also see the ink in the reservoir, it's on the sides, and particularly also on the back is, um, is a good coating of ink. I hope that what I shared was helpful for you. Uh, please leave any questions or comments um, below and I'd be happy to chat with you about your new calligraphy nibs. And uh, we'll see you again next time. Have a great day.